What's going on guys? I'm trying to keep it uh, non-copyright because they got music in the background. I'll show you guys my truck. So right now I'm about to give it a nice clean wash. Right, so what I'm going to do is walk around the truck. I like to do a uh, visual inspection. Just look at the deep down and dirty locations and then I'm gonna uh, hit those spots with a pre-wash which consists of water and soap. majority of the car washes that I've been to, I've seen the pre-soap option. However, not every car wash does the pre-soap actually work, such as this one. It takes a couple of minutes for to the soap to kick in, so by the time I get to the other side, the <laughs> soap kicks in. Uh, it's, a, it's such a headache. But, uh, what you want to do is start from top to bottom, top to bottom. You do not want to hit the trigger. You just want to lightly soak top to bottom. And that will basically help you loosen up that uh, dirt debris. In this case, we got salt because it was snowing prior. HPA beats. Alright guys, so we are officially done with the pre-wash. Now we're gonna move on to our uh, square brush. Now this particular brush it's very very soft. However, that does not mean that the brush is super duper clean that it won't scuff up our paint job. So be careful when you uh, use those uh, brush to wipe down your vehicle. Alright, so it's now time for a high pressure rinse. But um, I just want to point one thing out to you guys. Whenever you're washing a truck at a car wash it's gonna cost you some money like this one it costs roughly five dollars to start that's not enough money because <laughs> the timer is just quick but it's a, it's a wonderful wash um, but the timer is just uh, it's it's set on fast <laughs> I'm just gonna say that it's set on fast but uh, honestly uh, I usually bring uh, roughly fifteen dollars. I, I try to keep it within a fifteen dollar budget to wash my truck because one thing in this particular situation uh, it was snowing. The county put some salt in the road, so that fifteen ducks. I mean, the fifteen bucks, not ducks, is highly worth it. Highly worth it uh, because I'd rather spend fifteen to clean the paint job versus to spend hundreds of dollars <laughs> to repair the paint <laughs> or body or suspension frame like come on the money adds up so $15 that's all good to me baby
So here's the extra sauce top secret ingredient that I use to get that dealership deep ultra shine is using a triple foam conditioner. That thing works. It works and it's highly, highly recommended from me to you guys. Now, at the time of this recording, it was winter time, so the triple foam, it doesn't come out the way that it should, so as you can see here, I have to uh, basically splatter it on the truck, but uh, eventually you'll get it on there. It does take a decent amount of effort and time, but it's highly worth it. Apply the triple foam top to bottom, top to bottom. So, if you want that deep, rich shine throughout the whole vehicle, HPA you got to do it right, top from bottom. Yes, the finished product. A super duper rich deep shine. So it's common to still have some soap suds on your vehicle, especially uh, you know when it comes to the end, you trying to hurry up and do that last rinse before the timer <laughs> goes out because you're not adding any more money. You hit that $15 mark and you're like, look, I'm done. <laughs> but after this, you just pretty much want to wipe it down, get the, all of the water off and then add a uh, quick detailer and you're on the way home.